Jude Evans presents Mechasm by John T. Sladek. Original title, The Reproductive System, as read by Jude Evans. Copyright, 1968, by John T. Sladek, an Ace Book Publications, all rights reserved. Prologue. Did you see her in Haiti? Suppose that it is, once more, 1960, that fateful year. And suppose that you are passing through Milford, Utah, that most faded of crossroads. Population, a battered, bird-spattered sign informs you it's 3,810 and still growing. Home of the Shelley B... Home of the Shelley something. Milford lies about halfway between Las Vegas, Nevada and the North American Air Defense Command, NORAD, buried deep in the Colorado mountain. The name Milford is an honorific. There has never been a stream through this part of the desert, nor a mill, nor anything to grind in a mill. Perhaps it was named ironically, or wishfully. Founders of other desert towns have, after all, given them pretty names, hoping that, by some sympathetic magic, pretty reality would follow. Milford is not pretty. It is worn and warped. There is little to distinguish it from Eden Acres, Greenville, or Paradise. Its feed store, like theirs, is checkered red and white. Along its main drag lurk old familiar faces, the Eateria, the Idle Hour, Marv's Eat Gas, the Dew Drop In Motel. You, the casual tourist, say you are an Air Force general from NORAD on his way to get a divorce, are more interested in your odometer than that Coca-Cola bottling plant or whatever it is over there on the right. You're barely conscious of an ugly factory of glazed brick with a glass block window on its round corner. Wampler Toy Corporation, makers of the sign slides past you, lost forever. There is only one sign you are interested in. Resume speed. Ah, uh, there it is. And there's another. You are now leaving Milford, Utah, home of the Shelley Bell. Hurry back. Your foot comes down hard on the gas. The rattle of tappets say, who the hell is Shelley Bell? You are irritated with Milford. You are annoyed with your own faulty memory. You are bored with all ugly little desert towns with their smug signs. Biggest little city in the universe. You are hot and bored and tired. And you exceed the speed limit a little, fleeing from the place where world history is being made.